I'm sorry? Myself. Okay, so you tested yourself with your lesson. Is that is that what, what I'm hearing? Is that correct? I didn't uh, register to anybody. You didn't read your lesson to anybody, okay? And um, you were actually supposed to read your lesson to either your your brother or your sister. Either one would work, but you have to test it. You understand? Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. So I hear a little bit of a um, you know of a, a mockery going on in the voice. So we're gonna address that. But um, go ahead and recite this lesson. I'm going to hear how it sounds. Okay, so there's some pronunciation, some tajweed uh, issues, but mashallah, you, you did good with that overall. Um, go ahead and read the actual lesson though, sir. Thank you. Mm -hmm. سبح اسم ربك الأعلى الذي خلق فسوى والذي قدر فحدث. Okay, it's not قدر. Don't say قدر. It's قدر. It's a shadda. Okay, on top of the dal. Uh -huh. And make sure you underline it and circle it. You understand? You gotta underline and circle it. Excuse me. Do you understand? Yes, teacher. Very good. Okay, continue, please. It's not Qaddara, it's Qaddara, that. Qaddara. Okay. Okay. It's not Akhraja Mara, okay? It's Akhraja Al Mara, okay? You, you, what, okay, how, how many lines is that, Mas'uda? That's one and a half. All right. Um, read it one more time. Try to eliminate those mistakes, sir. Don't say sabbi hisma, sabbi hisma, sa, sabbi hisma, with a sin. Sabbi hisma rabbika al-a'la, al-ladhi khalaqa fasawwa, wal-ladhi qaddara, qaddara fahada, wal-ladhi akhraj, akhraj al-mar'a, it's not Fajalahum. Don't say Fajalahum. Say Fajalahu. Teacher, one mistake. Okay. Can I pass? Okay. Thank you very much. Um, I think. Uh, now, is there? Re is there? Excuse me. Let me. Let me ask something. Uh, your sister. Is there a reason why nobody? tested him before he attempted to read this because you know he's gonna have to redo this okay this, all right because i asked i asked you before and you said that you read it with the tv so i don't know now um did anybody t did anybody okay excuse me can i can i speak to your uh, constituents um did anybody test him is there a reason why neither of you tested him before he you know, came to class today. I mean, you guys didn't have yesterday class. You didn't have class yesterday, I'm trying to say. Yeah, teacher, I think he's saying that he, my dad tested him. Okay, now you think he, he's saying something, but you're responsible for it. Okay? Because you all know better. Anytime that, you know, he has to come on, you're all about to come on for your class, you need to start testing each other. So I, I, I've said, you know, numerous times that when it comes to your lessons, you you always need to test them before you recite them, though. You understand? Yes, teacher. Okay. Is your, is, is, where, where's your older brother? Is he there? 
Assalamu alaikum. Oh, okay. Wa alaikum salam. I, I don't hear, you know, much of your participation in the class. And I'm going to have to deduct some points off from that. So you just remember that. Did you practice your lesson, Chief? Yes, teacher. Good, good. Okay. Let, let's go ahead and let's hear your, your lesson. Uh, he's already recited the Fatiha. So just go ahead and recite your lesson, please. My lesson? Yes. All right. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم يا أيها النبي لما تحرم ما okay. الله لك okay. الله لك okay hold on a second start it start take it again from the top because seems like you you're missing out something there go ahead يا أيها النبي بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم يا ايها النبي لم تحرم ما احل الله لك تبتغي مرضات ازواجك والله غفور رحيم اوكي هولد اون ازواجك جيك نجيق دونت دونت بوت ا نيزل ساوند ان ذا جيم ازواجك Good, good, good. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm. Right. Okay, that, that is where you stopped, right? That's where you embarked on? Yes, teacher. Okay. Um, so you didn't test yours either, did you? I'm just, I mean, I'm making the assertion. Uh, it, it doesn't sound that you did. And I know your younger brother, he already, you know, admitted to the fact that he didn't do it. But it's very important that you actually test. Um, if you, you know, did you actually read it in your salahs, though? Did you do that? Okay, hold on a second. I, I'm trying to talk to one of you at a time. He, he just recited his lesson, so I'm trying to listen to him. Um, go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. What were you saying, sir? Teacher, I didn't memorize, didn't memorize it yesterday that well, so I didn't, re I didn't read it in Salah. You did not read it in Salah. Okay, so that's another violation because I explain this to you all, all the time. You memorize a lesson. Um, you know, whether you remember, you know, you said you did it yesterday. You could have recited it in Nawafil Salah. You know, you didn't have to wait for a Salah, to, you know, for you to pray Salah today. And even if you did pray your Salah today, you should have, you know, you have to be on, on target with this. So um, it's good, but it is not at standard. So you're going to have to redo that. Do you understand? Yes, teacher. Okay, and you make sure that you test from now on as you're supposed to as well, because, you, you know, it, it, it's good again, but it's just not up to par. And we need it to be up to par. You understand what I'm saying, sir? Yes, teacher. Very good. Okay. Um, well, well, go ahead and, um, and, and, and recite your, uh, let's see, I think you were doing Dur from, well, let, let's put that off for now. Uh, your, your, your sister, she also, did she have a, did you have a new lesson, ma'am? Yes, I did, teacher. Very good, very good. Okay, and did you test that or did you not? You did not test yours, you know, did you read it to your dad? Oh, uh, teacher, no. Okay, you did not read it to your dad. Okay. Um, okay. Teacher, 
from now on, we understand we're going to test each other. Yes, well, you know, I've, I've been saying, I'm glad you, you know, you, you, you're you going to do it from now on, but I hope, you know, you, you're going to stick yes. to your word on that. Uh, go ahead and, and recite your lesson, please. الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سبح اسم سبح لله ما ما سمع. okay I'm sorry repeat that again سبح you know you didn't take any سبح as yet you did take or oh, you took yeah. you سبح yeah I I, I سبح okay سبح. yeah it's سبح okay so so you know it's not anything else but go ahead say it again please بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سبح لله ما في السماوات وما في الأرض وهو العزيز الحكيم هو الذي أخرج الذين كفروا من أهل الكتاب من ديارهم لأول, الح... لأول الحشر ما ظننتم أن يخرجوا وظنوا أنهم ما نعمتهم وظنوا أنهم وظنوا وظنوا أنهم مانع ما مانع مانع مانعتهم. You need to underline, okay? Underline that and circle it. Make sure that you know you 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 know you pay closer attention to that particular word. وظنوا أنهم مانعتهم. Do you have the video on this sort of? I don't know, teacher. Okay, you don't know if you have the video or not? Now, that's a problem because you actually assigned this lesson with a video. So, um, you know, these are all violations. And, you know, the, the, the homework police are very serious about these allegations. So you all, you know, you need to get in line. If you don't have the video, you need to make sure you get the video. Do you understand? Yes, teacher. Very good. Okay, so continue from there. Well, then, and man, I do him like that. Go ahead. Well, then. Okay. 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 فأتى 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 فأتاهم الله من حيث لم يحت لم يحتسبوا وقا 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 ذاف في قلوبهم وقا 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 say it again take just kind of kind of remember you know recitation has has a number of codes and one of the codes is for you to be relaxed I mean you know so you need to well, it's connected to you being relaxed, but you, it's called comfortability. You have to be, feel comfortable. Just kind of relax and, you know, just uh, take your time uh, when reciting, all right? Uh, no, no sense in, in rushing or getting, you know, too edgy about it because at the end of the day, we all make mistakes, and Allah Ta'ala is the only one who's perfect here. So uh, remember that. But, well, but go ahead. Well, then... أنهم مانعتهم حصونهم من الله فأتاهم الله من حيث لم يحتسبوا like that وظنوا أنهم مانعتهم حصونهم من الله فأتاهم الله من حيث فأتاهم الله فأتاهم الله like that like that good 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 mm -hmm. Good, good, good. Abasar. 
Yeah, because the raw, the raw is, the, you got to fill up your mouth with that raw, okay? You got to fill it up, fill it up. All right? Um, mm -hmm. Good deal, good, good. Okay, that's where you stop. Okay, continue. Okay, all right. Uh, so this is a very important segment that talks about um, what you all need to understand, okay, for the Jannat Radio Station of America. Um, here in America, you, you definitely want to, you know, uh, come to terms about your purpose with this Quran. Okay. There's something very important you need to understand. And, um, first of all, you know, the prophets. So, you know, prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. And you know, prophet Jesus, right? Isa, right? Yes, teacher. Okay, and you know Prophet Isa, correct? Yes, teacher. Very good. Um, there's a very important lesson, and is that everybody is saying yes? Everybody's listening, or is it just one person? Because I'm only hearing one person saying yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Um, you know, the Quran was given for us to recite it um, and grow with it. Not to, not so much to actually read it, but to recite it, more so than anything. And um, the reason for that is because that's the way it was revealed. When I say that's the way it was revealed, that means that it was not given to the Prophet Muhammad like the tablets were given to Musa. Musa could read and write. Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam could not. Okay. Um, and Allah Ta'ala could have given him the wisdom to go ahead and read and write. He could have given him, made him start reading and writing right away. But what he did was he had the angel inspire the revelation into him. So that is the culture of the Qur'an. That's the tradition of the Qur'an. Okay. So when you're reciting that type of connection, you have to have it. And if you come to Prophet Isa, um, Isa, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala spoke through Isa, okay, like when he brought, um, you know, the life, when he brought the dead back to life, when he changed the bird, you know, the, into clay, I mean, the clay into the bird, when he did that, when he, you know, when he um, healed the leprosy and when he healed the, um, the, uh, the blind, all these things were done through Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's will. That's what the Quran says. You understand? And these are stories that are being related in the book of the Bible today. They're stories. But they're not what Isa actually said. The Quran, on the other hand, so there's stories written about, somebody wrote a story about, about Isa, and that's how it's in the Quran. Um, but the Quran, I'm sorry, that's how it is in the Bible. But the Quran is inspirational, it's the essence of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is light, because this is the, uh, the, 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 the method in which Allah raises us today. This is how he's protected his Islam. This is how he's protected, La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. By giving us the Qur'an for our hearts and it, in the same way that he gave it to Prophet. In the same way that he gave it to Muhammad alayhi salatu wasalam. You understand that? So, good. So when you, you know, when you are involved in reciting, you have to remember to be um, passionate mainly about your Islam. And Islam is all a discipline. It's an adab. It's a discipline. You learn this hadith, yes? Yes. Very good. Islam is an adab. So the Quran, learning it, has an adab. The salah has adab. Zakah has adab. The fasting has adab. It has a discipline. You cannot, you know, bring your own, 
you know, idea or your own way. You have to follow the discipline. So that is the point here. So mainly you have to be obedient. It's a matter of allegiance, the covenant obedience. This is La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So what I'm trying to get into you is become you know, more passionate and more mindful of your Qur'an because there's nothing better than it, nothing better than, than the Qur'an in the entire world, nothing better even than the Fatiha, even, 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 La ilaha illallah, there's nothing better than La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah in this world. So you have to, you know, take the discipline seriously, inshallah, and apply it, and, and uh, in your recitation of the Qur'an and um, you'll get closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that way. You know, you will actually pray more often with the Qur'an and you'll be able to recite it with more comfortability and more, you know, connection and everything of that that you actually need. Um, spending time, you need to spend time and just recite calmly, you know, comfortably and, uh, and, 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 uh, Remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala much with it. Make much dua for your parents. Make much dua for your parents. And respect your elders. You know, be obedient to those who are in authority over you. And when you're able to, to, to earn money, uh, think about giving it to those who have more of a right over it than you do. And when you think about going... When you think about going to work, think about earning so that you can go for Hajj and Umrah, inshallah, okay? Do you all understand? Yes, teacher. Okay. And um, inshallah, tell your dad I'll call him and uh, we'll, we'll talk later. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam, teacher.